Yeah. And so my child said to me, well, mom, you can also use any pronoun you want. You could be a they if you want. Because I get exhausted with she, especially the pandemic, just keeping my hair cut. It's like, it's like too much. So I go, oh, they, but, but then I would have, I imagine the emails going out and how exhausting it would be for everybody. And then my child though said, you know, I would support you and don't worry about being a problem for other people. It's whatever you want to be. And so, but they did say it really sincerely of kind of like you, mom, you can choose your pronoun, it's fine. And I'm with you. So I go, you would be great. I choose he, because if I'm he, instead of a mother, I'm a father. And that's so much better because as mothers you get if you bring the you know the store-bought muffins to the bake sale or whatever throw sand in a kid's face or whatever, like yeah, yeah. you're a bad mother but yeah. if a father makes a tuna melt once a year oh in the baby bjorn it's like he's fantastic and i go i'm a horrible mother but i'm an amazing <laughs> father and i was thinking like at the time for one thing as a mother i walk really badly i dress badly my hair's bad at one time i went to the pediatrician to hand over the vaccination slip, the yellow one, yeah. to the office staffer, and she slowly takes out a Kleenex and starts wiping it off because it has ants on it. Because my car has ants in it. And it was a, so I'm handing medical forms that have ants on it because I'm really <laughs> that messy. And so that's not what a mother does, but I go, you know what I would like to be called? I would like to be called your monster because I'm so unkempt, but I will, I will protect you. Or like you said, with the ogre, it's like, yeah, you yeah. Said, I'm your ogre. It's kind of like if anybody's throwing sand, throwing rocks at you, I will, I will do a football take and I'll hurl them over the fence. <laughs> or like I used to say to my kids, you know, if there's a body to be buried, I'll help you bury the body. You know, it's it's kind of like if you murdered someone, like so, you know, probably I'll get um, sued for just saying that. But but it's like I'm your monster, I'll protect you. And I actually found that talk with my trans child very freeing because they offered that to women and mothers. Choose your pronoun. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.